been Monday morning. Got some good sleep, but don't want to go to work. I hate this job. Oh well. It's time to get up and get ready for work. Alright, here we are. Num, num, num. Still waking up. I'm able to get out of bed earlier. So it's not past 8.30 yet. Uh, I am waiting for armored core to come out. Alright. I think I'll just have my banana and hold off on breakfast because breakfast is not much of my thing. Alright, Jax. Yeah? You want the delicious nectar of the bottled water? You're not supposed to breathe the water. <sighs> Monday is... Always the fun one of getting all the emails and going through them and so I'll have a little bit to do this morning. I'm really just waiting on the end of the week. Not much goes on with me. It's either one nerdy thing or another nerdy thing. Like staring at stars. Love it. It's kind of weird because, yeah, we would uh, see stars like poke through and then they just disappear and then they poke through and then like 10 minutes later they're completely visible and it would just constantly be like little ones that we just keep seeing more and more of. And then, uh, We would just lay there and then all of a sudden you'd see something shoot across the sky. And it would go across the entire sky in like one second or less. And we'd all see it, we'd be like, oh, there one went. And then like, let's say 20 minutes later, one would shoot upwards. And then another one would shoot to the right and then another one would shoot down. So they were pretty cool to see. If you weren't staring like at that specific moment, if you blinked, you'd probably miss it. But overall, aside from the drive, it was enjoyable. I cannot stand driving. It's just not my thing.
But alas, now we know what it's all about. We'll see if we ever go do that again or if uh, we find more spots to do that at. Who knows? The only problem is that all the spots are three and a half hours away or farther because the northern part of Michigan does not have much light pollution. It's pretty barren. That's why they're all small town people up there and they're not really nice. Yeah, very graceful of you, Jax. You tried jumping off the chair and it spun on him. But yeah, you people are really nice. If you're ever looking for some general good hospitality, that's where you want to go. But we'll see what other things there are to do around here. Now you're up there. He's just adventuring around all the counters. I'll get downstairs and play my games for about 20 minutes and then I'll start work. Yay, games! Alright, and reason number 83 of why not to have kids, if they get sick, you will too. I've got a runny nose. <sighs> but in the meantime, I'm making a sausage. Pulled it out of the freezer. We got the chubs of sausage. I Put it in the microwave for a minute and a half to warm it up, and then I chopped it into bits. The kind that we use is turkey sausage. And yeah, just warm it up a little just so that it can, you can get the um, wrapper off it nicely. And then you yeah, chop it up into little patties. So that's going, and then I'll probably just have some eggs with it. It's almost 11. <clears throat> what is that? 10.40? So, I'll be eating that. And I already took care of a bunch of tickets and morning stuff, waiting on more tickets. Let me see if there are any more. Nope, not yet. It's just been a bunch of clearing errors, so simple, easy, and got my morning stuff out the way, and if I can get a response from anybody of the emails that I sent out, then I can start working on other things. A portion of my job is waiting on responses. Kind of sucks, but I'm very limited in the power that I have. Yeah. He is begging for more food. Being the butthead. He doesn't like it when you scratch his ribs. So he instantly starts going to licking. And if you keep it up past the licking point, then he'll give you a little taste of his teeth. Yeah. He'll like do a little, like, ah, 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 and then if, if you annoy him enough, then he'll find it back. Just enough for you to be able to feel his teeth. But not anything to puncture or wound. 
and then he uh, get like um, if we were sleeping and her feet press against him in a way that's uncomfortable to him he'll do a quick nip at your feet and so over the years I've fixed that by chasing him down scaring the heck out of him now he's afraid He just thinks twice. You'll see it in his face when he goes about it. set up a little calendar reminders for myself because there's certain things that I do every two weeks or every month and so set up a little calendar thing so that I know to do them. So I'll get to modifying those and I'll send those out. These appear that they need some water in there now that I open up the lid. It was starting to turn brown on the pan. When it does that, I already know. So, yeah, and now they're fully cooked. <clears throat> that's why they don't have all the water in it now. And that's why I had to put the water in. So they're fully cooked, and so now I just gotta brown them up to my liking, and they're good to go. But I'm gonna change this battery and then pop back over there, make it. See, it happened instantly, like in a flash. You didn't even notice. I was that quick. Let's look at all that brown nastiness. That's just all the fats and liquids from these burning onto the pan. All right, fire's off. <clears throat> so we'll just let those simmer up. That's gonna be my breakfast. I'm not gonna go too crazy. I just want protein. Protein! That is done. And there we have it. Sausage. Let the pan cool down before I start rinsing it out. Don't want to warp it and mess up the Teflon. Right, Jax? He doesn't agree with me this time. Oh, well, look who's home. Oh, I just got home. Five, not even five minutes ago. I had to go get gas. Otherwise, I would have been home a little sooner. Making my peanut butter and jelly for lunch for tomorrow. And I'm running away. Goodbye. He's heading out to go get... Um, the salt for our water softener in the basement because we haven't had any in there since let's say May. 
I'm like, we really need to go get it. We really need it. like every week. I'm like, we need to go get it. We need to go get it. And we never go. So I'm making him go now. All right, well, lunch is made for tomorrow. I made an extra sandwich for me to eat right now because I'm starving. And I'm gonna go and edit the video after I make me a glass of milk, chocolate milk. This is my favorite cup that I use to make chocolate milk, but it's dirty. We had another cup from Little Joe's, which is a re local restaurant around here, that was about the same size, but it got dropped and broke. So I'll just use Little Sean's Coca-Cola cup, and then I'm gonna go edit. Here's back with the salt. How many did you get? Six. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Pop the kids got when we were doing, you can't even see me, the family fun day the other day. And was it sun, last Sunday? A week ago yesterday. Came with this little koozie. They left the no can chance. in the car. So did you get the one for free? Huh? Yeah. huh? Okay. If you buy 10 throughout the year, you get one for free. Thank you all. What's it called? Duo Cube Professional Grade Well type water softener salt. Cost us basically sixty five dollars. Sixty four ninety three. You want me to get the boys to come out? Okay. Carry them down. Yeah, because it's hot out today. It's like eighty degrees. What? Say hello. Everybody loves you. You're the star of the show. Right? Yeah. Something like that. Something like that. <laughs> At least in Brian's eyes. At least in Brian's eyes. Alright. I gotta go put some of this in the thing downstairs. One more. One more. You can do it. Oh, it won't. It's pretty not. Carry that one straight down. After you take your shoes off, you can see me. Close the door. Yeah. This is our utility room. It's pretty big. It's a furnace. The water tank's back there. That's our old, oh, what's it called? Oh, something system. OR system. Osmosis. For their water. Extra lights. Dehumidifier. The salt thing. It's been empty for months. Yep. I don't know what these are. I couldn't tell you. Like, this and this. Oh. <laughs> I don't know what that is either. I'm assuming it has something to do with the water. Oh, that's where we go. The Douglas water place to get it. It's been empty for the longest time. I'm assuming this is part of it too, since it has the Douglas water thingy on it. And then the last homeowners left that hose, that broom, that dustpan, and the shop vac that we've never used. And the sink that we've never used. And that whatever that is that we've never used, they left that up there too. What'd you say? Picked it up in waterfall. Oh, I think this big one next to it and this one on the bottom has something to do with that because they all say the Douglas water thingy on it. They'll say what? They'll say Douglas water conditioning services our specialty. It gives the phone numbers for Fenton, Holly, Brighton, Howell, and Heartland. So, I don't know. It's all part of the water system. Yeah, I don't know how they work, but they're all part of it. switch here. What's that to? There's a switch here. Yeah. I've never noticed that before. I'm not going to. I don't know what it's for, but I'm not going to mess with it. Put two in so far. Oh yeah, you can definitely put a third one. There's an extra toilet seat. Which I keep meaning to have Sean put on the boys' toilet. Because I have like a wooden toilet seat on their toilet and I hate it. What are these? Purple primer. Okay. What's this? Regular clear PVC cement. 
I don't know. I don't remember coming here. Am I in your way? Yeah. Throw another one in there. Yeah, it'll fit. Three of them. I mean, we haven't had any in there for about four months, which is probably bad for our water and for our pipes. How much have we? Oh, it's full. Don't you have to close it first? Mm. I don't know what he's doing. He'll figure it out. I'm gonna go back upstairs to edit in the middle of editing the video. One of these days I need to come down here. I don't know. One of these days I need to come down here and clean this mess up. Um, let's see what time is it? 3.45. Yeah, it's 3.45. Time to finish editing so we can go hopefully by 4 o'clock. Alright, we just made dinner, made chicken alfredo, and I burnt my arm draining the noodles. But here it is. We put the broccoli in with our chicken. These are the noodles we use. These, it's from Sam's Club. Egg pasta. You guys can even see it. But those are the ones I use for chicken alfredo. I buy one of those bags like once every four months or so, and it lasts us forever. But yeah, there's the alfredo. This is one of Skylar's favorite meals, so we go tell the boys that dinner's ready. And Sean's in a meeting right now because he was making it, but then he had a meeting. So I finished it up. Let's go get the boys so we can eat. All right, guys, it's the end of the night. I got a load of dishes going in the dishwasher. There's another load over there to do. But I'm getting sleepy. I'm gonna go lay down after I close up all these blinds in the house. Um, I have no idea if Sean will pick the camera up again tonight, but I highly doubt it. He's playing games with his friends downstairs online. So. Like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you tomorrow. Goodbye.